12th day into the race, and eight competitors are now sailing in the Southern Hemisphere. Jean-Pierre Dick is among them. The Pierre Bac Patrick skipper is well rested and well positioned. I'd say this was my first night rest with quite a few hours sleep. I took advantage that the pace and the waters were rather calm to rest. So that's a good thing. Anyway, but always in an attacking position. We'll see how it all unfolds, but technically and tactically, I'm on the dock. At the 4 p.m. ranking, the skipper from Nice is in fifth position, seven short miles behind Bernard Stam, who admitted yesterday having a few words. The boat was tossed about like a cork, with no wind. Sails hit the daggerboard. It's a tear that's not hard to fix as such, but I can't get the sail down. I'm a little concerned. The head of the fleet for almost a week now, Armel Lecléage doesn't give way. For the Banque Populaire skipper, as for his nearest pursuers, the time has come to negotiate the next stage. We're now going down the South Atlantic in the direction of the Cape of Good Hope. Before that, we'll have to get around the Saint-Hélène anti-cyclone. So I'll try to explain what's on the computer screen. We can see the fleet up here. The Cape of Good Hope there. And right in the middle, the Saint-Hélène anti-cyclone. And it's because it's very much south that we're forced to circumvent it going west. Otherwise, if we tried east, we'd have headwind instead of fair winds. So this is why we're going to make this detour. There may be some variations, but it's basically the way it looks.